I am their mother. As far as they're concerned, I am mommy. They, they rub me in the face, they'll let me kiss them on the nose. Having pet cats may sound run of the mill, but Janice Haley has taken her love of felines to the extreme, keeping two huge tigers in her back garden. Sabre, a 600 pound male white Bengal, and Janda, a 400 pound Bengal female, have lived with Janice since they were cubs. Despite tigers having a fearsome reputation, Janice has never been short of people wanting to help out. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Pretty much everyone that comes here to interact with them, my volunteers, are all basically part of their family. Like most young males, Sabre can get a little boisterous. But that's not enough to keep Carrie Eights from helping out. I don't get scared when the tigers are dragging me around the cage. They're doing it in, in play and it's a relationship that we have, especially Sabre. I've been there with him since he was two weeks old and had gone through all the raising and the training and just kind of growing up with him. You're not biting my nose. The playtime is, it's good for them and they don't make it scary. He's not aggressive when he's, when he's dragging me around. He's doing it out of our relationship and it <laughs> continues the bond, I guess. <laughs> 57-year-old Janice and her husband David work around the clock to care for six-year-old Sabre and 12-year-old Janda. Hi, are you going to let mommy in? But only happened upon their extraordinary life when she decided to quit her boring day job. This adventure began back in 1995 when I was working behind the desk doing tedious work and I really wanted to get back outside and my husband came up with this idea of working with these wild exotic animals. Janice understands people may disagree with her decision to raise the cats in captivity, but says Sabre and Janda have a good quality of life. People who consider it cruel to keep them in captivity have a point to a point. It is not the ideal place for a tiger to be in a cage, but at this point in the wild, there isn't a lot of hope for them out there anymore, and if there aren't some of them still left in cages, there aren't going to be any left at all in a couple of years from now. We hand feed them three times a day, every single day, and they are provided for and loved here. In my opinion, I wouldn't mind being a tiger in my backyard. After spending more than 12 hours caring for Janda and Sabre, Janice can finally try to get some rest herself before it all starts again tomorrow. Nighty night, guys. We'll see you in the morning. Have a good night. Love you.